Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 19 April 2024. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Senior Deputy Editor Martin Zua Kinyu asks whether Zimbabwe's new currency, Zimbabwe Gold or ZIG, will restore currency confidence. The heightened sense of urgency within Zimbabwe's government to act as the country's currency crashed was there for all to see in the past few weeks. The latest telltale sign was the assumption of office of the new central bank governor on March 28, a month earlier than the scheduled departure of his predecessor, to expedite the launch of a new unit, which was unveiled on April 5. The engineering news features focus on automation and Industry 4.0, where automated project manager scorecards enhance operations. Electric power transmission and grid services, where the energy grid impedes excess power transmission. And vessels, heat exchangers, tanks and containers, where a tank supplier intends to help South Africa navigate its water woes. The Mining Weekly features focus on tailings, retreatment and rehabilitation, where concurrent rehabilitation improves community relations. And drilling and tunnelling, where a driller foresees a revenue boost with a strong order book. This week's business leader is Rianne Capistagno, a partner at Partners in Performance. And as this week's cartoon shows, the storms that lashed the Cape earlier this month caused devastating damage, with many still picking up the pieces. One can only hope that the coming election storm is far more benign. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time. 